In 1986, OSHA issued the interim final rule for hazardous waste operations and emergency response. Four years later, this HAZWOPER rule was finalized. It affects workers at hazardous waste treatment, storage, and disposal facilities, hazardous waste cleanup operations, and emergency response operations involving hazardous materials. The purpose of this presentation is to help you understand the HAZWOPER regulation, your rights and responsibilities as a worker in this industry, and how to work safely around hazardous substances. Let's start with a basic question. What makes a substance hazardous? There is no simple answer. We need to look at several sources of information to get a complete definition. In OSHA's hazard communication standard, a hazardous chemical is defined as any chemical which is either a physical hazard or a health hazard. According to OSHA, physical hazards include combustibles, flammables, explosives, oxidizers, organic peroxides, reactive chemicals, and compressed gases. Health hazards include sensitizers, irritants, corrosives, toxic and highly toxic agents, and carcinogens. The U.S. Department of Transportation lists the materials it considers hazardous in its hazardous material table in 49 CFR 172.101.